Hello YouTubers, uh, today I'm going to show you how to set your screensaver so you can view your your personal pictures. Uh, so right click your desktop which is anywhere there's not an icon. Put left click properties and this new box will pop up. Under here you'll left click screensavers at the top and in the middle you'll see this um, drop down menu under screensavers. Just left click it look through here until you see my pictures slideshow and left click it now you can click settings and depending on where your pictures are stored uh, you might have to browse for them uh, if not it automatically goes to your username's my pictures folder which is under your documents my pictures now these are the pictures that will be displayed when the screensaver kicks on if that's not where your pictures are uh, there's really the concept is the same. You can just click browse and just go to wherever your pictures are and then just click OK. Um, but if they're there and that's where you keep them, uh, you can set the time, how long it takes to change a picture, uh, how large or small they are. Then you can come down here and click stretch small pictures, which will make it 100% bigger. But the only problem with that is it'll be real pixelated. You won't be able to tell really what it is. So I would leave that unchecked. I can show the file names if you if you go through and name all your pictures. Um, I don't. All mine are called pictures or zero zero pictures. I really don't have no no uh, no picture named what it is, so that wouldn't do me any good. But if you name your pictures, then by all means click show file name. So when people come by and look at your screensaver, they can see what it is and who it is and or whatever you name it. Uh, this option here, these transition effects, that just gives you when it switches pictures, it'll either slide or it'll zoom in and zoom out it just affects and now once you get all your settings click just click OK and if you want to see what it looks like beforehand left click preview and there you go uh, that'll scroll through all my pictures that I have in the my pictures folder um, like I said if you have them somewhere else just go there and click the pictures you got and that's how you make a screensaver of all your personal pictures all right, hope that helps somebody YouTube, and if you have anything else you want to learn or have any questions about anything, feel free to leave me a comment or email me at whotookthenames2000200 at, at gmail.com. All right, have a good night, YouTube.